Lord Jesus Christ, Son of the living God, who during your earthly sojourn went about doing good, alleviating the people's suffering and infirmity, and restoring bodily and spiritual vigor to the paralytic lying on his pallet. Look with favor, we pray, on the faith and compassion of your servants, who animated with true charity by your example as well as by your command, are sending these ambulances and medical supplies to bear the wounded and the sick amidst the Ukrainian people to bring them a place of healing as they suffer the onslaught of war. Yeah, today uh, we're receiving the 38th ambulance um, for our effort to get uh, U.S. ambulances to Ukraine. Um, this ambulance, uh, uh, donated by, by NHealth here, is um, going to be part of a um, 10 ambulance, 5 fire engine shipment that will be going uh, the middle of April. It'll leave uh, from the East Coast, go on ship and uh, get across to uh, Germany, and then it'll be trucked to a location in Poland where we will then um, fly over, meet up with them, and uh, we will drive them into Ukraine. And, you know, we've been in business for six years, and up until this point, we've been blessed with some amazing opportunities. And, you know, we've been able to help the community in a lot of different ways, sending crews around the country to assist with FEMA. And when I heard what the U.S. Ambulances for Ukraine was doing, we had just purchased two ambulances, and two were going to get retired, but they still had a lot of life in them. So what was really, you know, my wife and I own this with our kids, and we kind of pray for ways to help. And this really presented itself. This just was a great opportunity and almost down to the day. In fact, at the ceremony with the, the other ambulances, we're getting all the paperwork together. So it's like, you know, same day, same week, the new ones come off and the old ones come on or, you know, get retired. So this was just, it was a, a great opportunity to donate the ambulance. We had a lot of old stretchers too. And I say old is that a lot of them have been upgraded to power cots, but these are the manual ones, which seems to be in this, this climate of going off into war that this is a good fit.